Welcome back on my Lanta. It has been a while. Um, and I I just I apologize for such a long wait. Um, but without further ado, let's get into Young Life update for I mean January, February, March, April. Here we go. Let's get into it. For those of you who know me, welcome back. Hello. And for those of you who are not privy to this channel or know me, I'm Sly Williams. I'm an air director on the east end of Pittsburgh. I've been here for almost four years with my smoking hot wife, Amy, a beautiful baby boy, Phoenix, and I have a beautiful son who lives in California named Braden, and uh, our family is doing very well. Needless to say, I often, and I was pretty good at it, I was good at doing monthly updates video-wise, or what they would call vlogging, and so I apologize seriously for such a long wait. Um, however, if there could be an excuse, I, I would at least want to offer up a reason as to why um, it took me so long to get back to everyone as far as in this in this form. Um, but in the since December, um, I've been to Colorado, Texas twice, Virginia, West Virginia, Arizona, California. Um, all for different reasons, but primarily training and then also some opportunities that I had um, with Young Life as well um, that I would say were once in a lifetime opportunities that I was able to experience. And so all great things. Um, I would literally talk your ear off if I try to explain everything that I did. However, instead of doing that, um, I'm just going to show you just little pieces of what I got to experience, whether I was at a camp or at an event or a training, and I just kind of give you a picture, a piece of what I'm doing. And that's why I do these video updates, too. Um, I could easily do a newsletter, and that's just not my style. Um, however, for the sake of time, I probably could have sent that out, but I'd rather wait and give you better quality of explaining what I get to do. And you guys get to see that, and that's the biggest thing I do or reason why I do video updates because I love giving donors and giving people that support in other ways as well um, a lens to look through to see what I get to do and what I get to be a part of on a daily basis with kids, with people on committee, um, with people in the community, um, and who I get to meet and just where I get to go. So without further ado, check out this series of different events that I was a part of over the last four months. And when you get back, we'll kind of look at what's ahead or what's been on my heart, and we will land this plane. Oh, my land to take it in. I'm here with a bunch of other people for Minister as a Person, class with the Young Life. We're at Lost Canyon Camp. Here we go, Fall Weekend. Go to that Fall Weekend. We the Weekend. We the Weekend. Here we are in San Antonio, Texas. Let's go. About to get some tacos or maybe something else. We don't know yet. Stay tuned. Check this out right here. Lone Hollow, Vanderpool, Texas. Hey, hey, hey. He comes with this package too. You can have all of this in him. Oh my gosh, beautiful. Yes. Man, after a long day of hard work, you come out here, take it all in. Nice and easy. All right, made it here safely to LA. About to get our California burrito yeah, and then take it in before we make it our way out to Ojai, California for the table, table. <laughs> uh, stay tuned, it's gonna be a great week. Out here with Chili, Mike, Chili, Chill Coat. This is the best one ever. Thank you, that's good. Wait, how did you? I made it. This is, this is so good. Before. I'd have to see the. I'd have to see the. So this is how I even came to know Chile really quick. And it was this guy's province actually. I'm from Philadelphia. I'm at my school. Yeah. We got some Philadelphia. Three people. Yeah. All right. That's good. I love it. Yeah. We got a good thing going already. 
But I'm from Philadelphia. My smoking hot wife is from Pittsburgh, and uh, she's beautiful. You probably seen her around, around her somewhere. But needless to say, there she is. No, that's that's what she's doing. She's amazing. <laughs> Get that video from you. This mess, I mean, it's bigger than the plate. This is crazy right now. God bless We're living it right now. <laughs> Every time we are at. I mean, I seriously am in awe of what I get to do, what I get to be a part of. Um, not even just with these four years with Young Life. I definitely think it's heightened my awareness of what I get to be a part of. And I would say recently in this you know, past month or so, this is something that has come to mind, but I wasn't the most ambitious kid. I love my family. They were super supportive of everything that I wanted to be a part of, um, but I wasn't, um, I wasn't an ambitious or motivated kid. And so I was a part of a lot of things, but I never knew exactly what I wanted to do. And so doing or being a part of what I get to be a part of now is, is seriously is a win. So every day I wake up, it pretty much is the best day of my life. Um, Cause I never thought that I would ever get to this point. I never um, could have wrote up the scenarios um, of the life that I get to live now with my family, with friends, with the opportunities that I get to walk into. And I don't say that to boast. I say that in the sense of if you have breath in your lungs, like God, is working, he is willing, and he can change you. He can continue to direct you exactly where he wants you to be. And so to take appreciation for the small things in your life will allow you to really appreciate um, to a magnitude the, the larger things in life. So I'm so, I'm humbled um, by the way and the ways that I get to live my life. Um, okay, so what's next? Oh, he, oh, he, he messed him up. Yeah, this is what's next. Being with kids. I, I just love, that is probably probably the, my favorite part of what I get to do. I mean, traveling is great. Um, having meetings with adults in the community, um, establishing partnerships, all phenomenal. But there's nothing like sitting down with the kid, especially when you don't know them at first. And they just, they, they, you see something in them before they see it. And you, over time, get to speak life into them and tell them of God's promises. And through all that, you start to see um, them catch that vision more about for themselves, too. So that's been my favorite part. Um, this is, just check these videos out. They're, they're goofy, but they just, they just bring joy to my life. So check them out. Hey, hey, hey. Because <laughs> 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 I'm not coming in because I got my boy mode sitting right here with his phone. Yeah, my boy Sly recording in the background. I don't even know what to say next. It's, it's so much fun being with all those guys. Um, and just with the leaders too, uh, with, with George, um, as you can see, we, we have a new leader, Juju, AKA Juliet. Actually, her name is Juliet, but we call her Juju. Actually, check this picture out of the, the latest uh, Dice team. Uh, she is studying at Duquesne University. She is phenomenal. She came in trails blazing, just got placed and within a week was doing campaign or weekend with us. And it was so much fun. She really, I think, she, I believe, she feels supported and cared for and being loved. And so tying her in with some girls right now has been great. Taking her to the school, doing contact work, just meeting kids, just building up relationships um, is where she's at right now. And so, so thankful for Juju, so thankful for George as well. But being able to just have this team come together and be a part of it all has just been so great.
I'm, I'm well, it seems like I'm, I'm compacting so much um, events or opportunities that have all been coming my way over the last pretty much like four or five months. Um, and each video or update will not be like this. Um, actually, they'll be longer, but it'll be specifically for that month. Uh, but I want to give you guys some type of idea of like where I've been, what I've been up to over the last four months. Um, if you don't, you know, know me. However, my information, if you need it, is in the comments or actually in the description below. In my phone number, my email address. If you just want a cup of coffee, if you just want to hop on a phone call, if you want to know more about Young Life or what's going on in the area, please do not hesitate to reach out. With that being said, we're gonna get into prayers, and um, you can be praying for the family just overall that they stay healthy. Phoenix is thriving right now. I mean, he is just living it up. He is talking and walking, and he has a curiosity about him that just makes me um, just be reminded of how I need to be curious about things um, in the same way that God sees me and just smiles down on us and just loves us. Um, you can be praying for Amy. She's just, she's the best friend, best mother, best of wives, um, that anyone could ever have and so I'm so thankful for her and just the way that she supports me and just is just loves Phoenix and loves myself so well and those around her we pray for the area we have a lot going on um, right now we have campaigners we start club um, in a couple of weeks with um, with another area that I've been being able to somewhat co-lead and help them kind of build some things up as well so you can be praying for us our first club is April 25th, so um, you won't get the, the next update until beginning of May or even at the end of end of April. So um, you'll see what, what happens. So just pray that kids show up and that we get the opportunity to love them and just meet them exactly where they're at. Um, same thing with campaigners. We're hoping to have girl campaigners start up soon. Guy campaigners is going well. So you can be praying for that. That just continues to be consistent and constant for those, for those boys. And then if we do start co-ed campaigners, which will probably be in May or something, just pray that we can make that all work out because those kids are wild. They are absolutely just rowdy, but they are, they're great. We have, um, you can be praying for me. I'm speaking at Memorial Day weekend or leader weekend. And uh, yeah, just that I really carve out time to really focus in on what God wants me to speak on. Um, and also just put it together because I can easily blow off an assignment and just be with people and, you know, use that as an excuse, but really allocate time because it is important and I, I know it's important. So making sure that I, I, I surrender time to that. Um, you can be praying for margins in my life that I am continuing to lead as a father, as a husband, but also as an air director that I'm leading through all those things in a very healthy way. Um, that I'm giving time and ear to, you know, Amy to Phoenix, but also to other needs in the in the area and realizing I can't resolve them all. And so that I trust God with those things and that I find time for myself, self-stewardship. Um, I would say for now, like that's, you know, that's the biggest thing. Kids, of course, that they just continue to feel loved and cared for and um, that there's opportunity that they get to walk into. Um, also, this coming week, we are taking a bunch of guys to the Pittsburgh Symphony and we're getting dressed up, which I'm really excited about because a lot of those guys, like they never get to do that. So we get to go to the, the Pittsburgh Symphony and then we're going out for dinner. So that'll be in the next update as well. So just praying that that goes well. The list can continue to go on, but those are the things that are just like on my heart right now that I'm thinking about. So be praying for those things. If you want more information, once again, my information is in the description below, phone number, email address, Whatever is comfortable to you. If you want me to pigeon carry you, I can. Just let me know your information. Um, I end every video with this, and I truly do mean it. If you haven't heard it from anyone else, please hear it from me. You have meaning, you have value, you have purpose. Go out there, continue to be a part of um, what God has called you to, and, and know that you were created with much reason. Peace.